Hi friends, now we're going to talk about how we can get all the relevant information related to business partner. Business partner is the new thing in s 4 where every customer, vendor and employee is created as a business partner. So if you go to SC11, so you just need to know one of the tables which is BUT000. Once we go to display and we'll just click this one and I will be able to get all the relevant important tables associated with business partner okay so if you want if you know there are things like ID numbers and all those things that are specific for business partners to determine whether it's a ad and vendor or it's a different type of you can put characteristics here here you can see all these banking details all this information you can get it very easily without scrambling to know which is the table it would be and all those things from here now if i scroll down i can find other informations like the parameter id okay so here if you want to default some parameters you can put it here vp role is very important where you can put parameters id associated with it similarly you can find all the search help that you can be using okay bupa business partner here you might have want to add a new search help that you can easily add it uh, without without much scrambling here what are the different uh, uh, search help associated with it from here you can find different uh, cds views that has already been created for this business partner this is one cds view which will be very important and other cds views which you can use now you can find all the different out of the box programs that has been associated with business partners similarly you can find all the function group so inside the function group you will find for sure some function modules that you can use it for your own help so here you can see all this help for related with uh, with search help similarly if i want to find something related with other stuff right uh, if i want to find geolocation or update address from here i can find all these function models that you can use very easily and you can use it for your uh, enhancements or custom uh, developments that you might be using okay uh, from here also you can find authorization objects of course you need those because you want to hide employees from showing to everyone you know there are uh, some uh, statutory requirement for every company for every countries that you can do okay so if I close the dictionary tables you can find all the views that you can use okay there is CDS views here you can see and there are normal views that you can you know use it uh, right there okay so this is very very important okay let me find whether there's anything related with transactions okay let me go so if I see I have set get parameters I have authorization objects I went through so if you want to see number range objects you can find all these number range objects that is associated with business partner okay and what more I think that's it so you can find all this information just by going into the table and from the table you just click on this this thing and you can get all this information